Hi, I'm Joyce, and I'm going to show you how to do a clip comparison. Clip comparisons allow teachers to very easily compare up to three clips on a side-by-side -side view. I'll show you exactly how to do that. First, we go to My Clips, Clip Comparison, and let's go ahead and create one from scratch. Going to New Comparison, let's compare simile and metaphor, and we want to go ahead and see how similes and metaphors are used in the context of a conversation. Click Submit. From here, you can compare up to three clips, and it's very easy to find the clip. Go ahead and click the plus button. And here you can see there are three options from where you're able to choose the clip. From an existing playlist, so let's say you're an ELA teacher, you've already created a list of literary, a clip collection of literary devices. Maybe it's from your personal clips, you found something off of YouTube, or it's something that you yourself created. Or the most popular search is through the classic library search. So here we can do a search for metaphor. And if you'd like, you can even go as granularly and check on maybe it's an elementary school clip or middle school clip. Um, you can also check on the clip length. Maybe you just want something that's less than a minute. Um, and you can also go as much as looking into the decade. So maybe you are looking for a clip um, from the 1970s because that's the, the unit you're teaching. For the purposes of this demonstration, we're just going to go ahead and have no filter and see what comes up. Here you can see what kind of, um, what are some of the results when you look up metaphor. We see a clip from Boy Meets World. We see something from The Good Place and there are pages and pages of search results. So you can see the breadth of content we have and maybe we choose Moana. You're able to go ahead and click and actually view the clip in its entirety or you can just select it. So let's go ahead and select it from here. I've already seen Moana, I love the movie, and I wanna make sure my, my students also um, have access to this. So we have Moana here. Now we want to go and click for a simile. Let's see what shows up with a simile. So we see a Pocahontas clip, Aladdin, Forrest Gump, uh, and staying on the same page of kind of an elementary school clip, I will go ahead and choose a Pocahontas clip. So I do a side-by-side -side comparison. I have one of Moana, one of Pocahontas, and here I'm able to add a discussion question. So this helps me plan out this entire activity. I'm able to think through uh, what exactly I want the students to arrive at. So the driving question is, what is the metaphor in the clip? And what, maybe that's the first one. So we go ahead and submit. And maybe the second question is, what is the simile in the clip? And what is the difference between simile and metaphor? Great, and submit. So here we go. We have already just created a very quick clip comparison, a simile and metaphor, and here's how we go and access it. So I save my changes, go to clip comparison. Here is what I just created. It says the objective, the total clips, and I have the date that I created it on. So let's say uh, next week, Tuesday, my ELA class, I can go ahead and pull up this page, pull up this clip comparison, and drive the activity. You're also able to watch the clip directly from this page, so you don't have to go to another window. It's all right here. Um, that's just how quick and easy it is to create a clip comparison on Classic. We look forward to seeing what you create. Thanks.